Hello students, uh, I want to officially welcome you to the Kenya Highlands uh, University Online Learning Management System. I'll be taking you through several video tutorials on how to use our University Odell system. I know this may be new to many of you, but I want to assure you that uh, we will give you all the support that you need so that uh, you are comfortable and you'll be able to use the system to conduct uh, your learning. So we will begin this series of tutorials by showing you uh, how to access the Odell system. There are two ways to access the system. One is through the university website, and the second, which is uh, www.khu.ac.ke, which we are all familiar with. And the second option is by typing in the Odell system uh, URL, which is www.elearning.khu.ac.ke on your browser, and you will be able to get to the system. So let me show you how to access the system. Uh, but to do so, you must also have a correct login information ahead of time, which I'm sure you must have been given. Uh, by the Odell office so that you can do so. Otherwise, without login information, you won't, you won't be able to log to the system. Okay, let's begin and uh, access the system together. Uh, right now, we are on the university website and we are all familiar with this website. So how to get to the system, you will have to go to the portals uh, menu and under portals, there are three different items. So you need to look for e-learning. And when you click on e-learning, it should be able to take you to the, uh, the portal where you can now begin to log in to the system. The other alternative, as I said, is you can uh, type e-learning, uh, e-learning.khu.ac.ke, and it will take you to the same, uh, the same place where you can log in to the system. Um, so once you get to this particular uh, landing page or portal, at uh, the right hand corner, you have a place where you can log in. So when you click, I mean, when you uh, click on login, uh, you should be given a, a place or a provision to log into the system. And there we are. So uh, assuming that you have your login information and if you don't have, you need to do. Uh, you need to get contact the Odell lobby so that you can be given uh, your login information. Uh, you just log in with the information that uh, you've been given. And in this particular uh, tutorial, we'll be using test student number one as the username, and then uh, of course the password also. You can you can use the password that uh, you've been given. And as soon as you log in, you'll need to change your password to something that you like. Um, as, as soon as you log in, you will be uh, greeted by uh, this page, which is really the welcome page. Um, now, once you are in, there are a couple of things that you can do. One uh, is to get to the dashboard. Dashboard is where you can access your classes, if you have any classes. And if you don't, then that's also where you can, uh, you can be able to enroll yourself into a class. So to get your dashboard, and by the way, in order to be sure that you are in your account, uh, make sure the name that reads uh, besides uh, besides um, the image up there, to the right hand corner, is your name. Otherwise, you could be in somebody else's account. Um, besides the username, it's a little arrow we call it the drop down menu. If you click on it, it gives you a couple of options there. Uh, one of the options is the dashboard, which is very critical. You really need to, uh, you'll be using dashboard in just about everything that you'll be doing. The other option also is the profile. Profile is where you can, uh, you can change uh, your homepage to look like the way you want it to look like. In other words, you can even add a photo, which we, recommend that you add a photo to uh, your, uh, 
to your account so that at least your fellow students will be able to recognize you when they uh when they see you uh, because you'll be able as uh, as we move along you'll be able to understand why it's important to have a photo on your your page just like any other profile like the facebook and things like those ones uh another place to access your photo uh, your dashboard is also to the left hand corner you can see uh place where it says dashboard uh, so in the next video i'll be showing you how to uh, uh, sign up or enroll for classes uh, and then uh, what is really on the dashboard so uh, thank you and i'll be happy to see you in the next video thank you so much